Hello, it's me again. Good afternoon. We are still working along here in this house that I showed you yesterday, and I thought I would show you how it's coming. Let me flip you around here. I have Angie and Natalie working hard. Hi, Abby. Oh, 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 that was nice. I hit the wrong thing, but look how bright it is, huh? I hit the wrong button, <laughs> but it lit up like crazy. Okay, so I got a chair in the way here. Let me back up. So here's where we are. We have one coat of primer on everything except this part of the hearth because we keep standing on that. And then you can see how the primer is here. So it really sucked it up. It really um, uh, went down in that brick. See that? And that's really a really pretty um, look in itself. What do they call that? They call that look something, and I can't even think. And they put a little bit of um, uh, drywall mud on it and make it all uh, inconsistent. Oh, and I forget what they call it. My friend uh, Missy, Tom, called it something, and it was such a cool name, and I'd never even heard of it before. So, of course, I had to go research it. <laughs> So, anyway, now we have uh, the first coat of paint on this area here. Natalie is working on the trim, um, so it looks great. It's much brighter, as you can see. So, I just wanted to show you guys the progress of this. This has been an issue right here because it doesn't come out from the wall, but just a tiny, like, like, that much. So I'm going to use some aluminum foil, I think, and tuck that, try to shimmy that in behind and then fold it back around. And then we'll be able to push the paint back in there like we need to. So that's been an issue. The other issue is we've got like, we've caulked this brick line here where it looks much better than having that dark gap. But, and then we've caulked all of our uh, you know, trim up here at the ceiling and at the wall. But what we've got here, see this gap that we've got? And in person, it's really quite big. Um, it really gets big. So they make some foam tubing that I buy at Lowe's. And I didn't bring it on this job, but I'm going to run and get that for the girls. And uh, we're going to stuff that up in there so that the caulking will have something, um, like when we, when we shove that uh, foam up in that gap, the caulking will have something to stick to when we rub it. So anyway, I just want to give you guys a really quick peek at our progress. There's Angie working hard. <laughs> Say hey, girl. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> and um, that's all I have. That's all I have. Whoops. So I'm going to get going. I'm going to go get them some supplies. And um, I just want you guys to see how it was coming. I think it looks great. Have a good day. Bye.